good old nether realm. Oh, what up, everybody? Welcome back to another 25 Days of Mortal Kombat. My name is Uncaged Games. If you guys don't know, Nether Realm, makers of Mortal Kombat and Justice and other great games like that. Their studio is located in good old Chicago. And recently, I had the privilege and honor, no, not to visit Nether Realm Studios, but go to Chicago for C2E2, one of the biggest conventions in Chicago. And I've never been, heard a lot of great things. So we go there for one day and see all the MK stuff we can find, all right? Because Chicago, Nether Realm, there should be a lot of Mortal Kombat, right? Anyways, make sure you guys are subscribed to the channel, ring the bell icon, like the video if you guys are enjoying the 25 Days of Mortal Kombat. We are so close to the end of this long journey. So if you guys have been here since the beginning, drop a thumbs up. And uh, without further ado, enjoy this episode of the 25 Days of Mortal Kombat. Us taking on C2E2 for the first time. What up, everybody? Welcome back to another video. Today, we're at C2E2 for the first time ever. I've never been here. Really excited. Let's see if we can find some Mortal Kombat stuff. Let's go. Spot some games. Let's check it out. Can't zoom in. Nope. Steve Cardenas. Guys, guess who it is? Yo, what's up? This is Steve Cardenas, Rocky the Red Power Ranger, and you just got caged. Oh, snap! <laughs> that was close. 150. Goodness gracious. Man, uh, this is my first C2E2, and I am actually overwhelmed uh, with how much stuff there is here. Maybe it's because we only have like an hour left of the convention before it closes or I'm just really tired from standing in line all day, but uh, I need to take a nap. They have every single game except for Mortal Kombat. What is Hanzo doing here? What is Hanzo doing here? The Pug Army. I met him today. She found something, boys. <laughs> Minecraft. I spot with Eagle Eye. Mortal Kombat. <laughs> so, they have the gold spawn. I already have one. But mine's a little damaged. I'll think about it. They got so much classic Marvel Legends, it's crazy. And I actually had a lot of these as well growing up. I had this one. That was my favorite, that was my favorite one. Oh, and this one too. And I had that one. We found some more Mortal Kombat. We got a spawn blue and white variant. We got the brand new spawn uh, medieval armor. And we got the two pack. I have that one. And I actually have these as well. So it's very hard to find things I don't have Mortal Kombat. Again, I think I'm missing like one McFarlane MK figure. And I think that's like Red Katana. Wait a second. I don't think I have this one. I don't think I have this. What were you just saying? I 
I hope I don't have this one because then I'm gonna have duplicate, but all right, let's uh, possibly get this. So I don't know if I have that Shao Kahn or not. I don't think I do. I think that's the second variant color, but the guy was asking 40 bucks and the box was super dented. The funny thing is there's a sticker on the bottom that says 20 bucks, but he was asking 40. I think he was saying 40 because of the camera. You ain't getting me. when I was <laughs> when I was younger. See I had that. I had the Joe. I had the Joey and the Yugi. Or the starter deck. Then I opened it. And now there, there's so much. Uh, so much. Alright. Total combat spawn. The bloody variant. I need to carry a list because I don't know if I have that. But then there's also this. Yes, I have that. Do I have some? I really want to say you have that. I really want to say I have this as well. I'm pretty sure you do. Oh man, I'm gonna regret this if I don't have it. Sorry. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna go with my gut. My gut says I have it. Ooh. Putties. <laughs> We found some more Marvel Legends. Marvel Legends. We found some more McFarlane MK figures. Um, see, the other booth had it for 40. This one's 24. That's why you got always check. All right. Uh, no, I just, I just noticed it. I think uh, I have all of them. You check the bottom one? Yeah. Let's see this. I think I do. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I, uh, I don't know anymore. I think I, you do have something. This is why this I can't do by everything more come anymore. Every time the snow is falling down and it is cold outside, we gather around the fireplace and no one cares about yesterday. How's it going? Uh, it's going well. Um, I lost Rock, Paper, Scissors to Johnny Cage. It happens, you know. I, I, can't, I can't beat the OG. Johnny is down to 750 for this weekend, which is 3,000. Uh, Venom is 3,000. Um, 450, 450. So you said that Johnny is what, 750? Johnny is 750, yeah. Can I see it? Yeah, absolutely. Uh, so all his paintings are uh, they're finished on the sides, right? They're clear coated on the back. Their sign, the paintbrush, and the bandana that he was wearing when he did it. That's all amazing. there, right? They're all dated. That's the color original. This is one of one. Crazy detail, right? That is amazing. Uh, all right, 750? Yes, sir. Okay, we're gonna do it. I just bought that for 750 bucks. That's David's painting. That's it. That's going in the office. <laughs> all right. Any for Johnny, he's my boy. One of one, rare. You on Cook Games? I am on Cook Games. <laughs> holy shit, I watch you all the time! <laughs> Thank you so much. I was walking by and I'm like, holy crap, the green glow from Johnny saw me. Oh, that's and I'm awesome. like, oh, do you have one of these? And I asked yeah. about the, the one of one, and I'm like, okay, I want the uh, original. Did you just get Johnny Cage? No, I got that. I, 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 want, I, want, I bought that one. I have to have it in my office. It's a must. Thank you very much. Oh, oh, God. That's a drink on too. Thank you. Take every print you want. Are you serious? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Please. I can, I can just take any Mortal Kombat one I want? No, I come home from work. I go up to the studio, pick Mortal Kombat 11 stuff. My yeah. wife's like, why are you watching this? I'm like, I don't know. He's awesome. <laughs> <laughs> you don't have a booth here or anything? No, I'm just here to visit. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Awesome. So I just get to... Uh, Dude, this is, this is you're too kind. This is dollar each. <laughs> wow. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. 
Thank you so much, dude. Oh yeah, man. Thank you for what you did. What's your name? I'm Derek. David. I'm a self-taught artist. I started out doing Bob Ross Landing. That mountain, yeah. That, like, I, I saw Johnny, like, okay, if it's not a Johnny or that one, I had to get Johnny. Are you yeah. doing a Mortal Kombat thing? Um, I mean, possibly. <laughs> like, you're at Grand Rapids and yeah. all that stuff. Yeah. I'm like, I'm gonna, like, I don't know how I didn't run into you yet. And, like, for some reason, I always felt like this Johnny Cage was meant for you. And it's insane that you have it. I mean, like, in my world, it's insane. You know what the funniest thing is? I was in line for Hayden Christensen, right? Yeah. And this guy was also in line. He kept looking at me and he's like, are you on Cage Games? I'm like, yeah. So we started talking. He's like, I don't know if you saw, but there's like this really awesome booth that has like Mortal Kombat, like paintings and artwork. I'm like, really? He's like, yeah, there's a giant cage one. So I'm like, okay, cool. I'll, I'll check it out. <laughs> so I walked by and I saw, I didn't know he was talking about this one. Oh, yeah. And I, I had to get it. it. It's so funny when I when I see you do buy everything yeah. Mortal Kombat and you're like buying stuff that's digital yeah. and not earned by a traditional Orders, I'm like, Ur! like if you only knew mm. what's out there. Yeah. Like when I earn it by brush, like you may never see this. But we're dying. Great. You may never get this again. Uh, like it's so crazy you have this. Like you have no idea. Well, I'm honored to have it. I'm honored that you. <laughs> like I feel even bad for charging you. But I have three cats. Yeah, I mean you gotta pay. You gotta pay for the food. You gotta yeah. pay for the food. So you like, don't leave him. He's on his way up. <laughs> Whatever you do, don't leave him. I'm gonna shrink wrap this okay, one yeah, so it's yeah. safe. Okay? Like I'm a romantic, I'm not an artist after followers and stuff. So uh, celebrity doesn't matter. I have several celebrity clients and stuff. Mm -hmm. uh, it's not about that for me. When I'm not doing Comic Con stuff, I paint like dead babies, and okay. puppies, and cats. Of course. And I paint at Comic Con when it's time. So. I'm self taught. A trailer park kid in the middle of nowhere, Pennsylvania. Now I'm meeting you today. It's an honor. Thank you very much. Thank you. And I'll watch you forever. <laughs> Thank you so much. Cool. He's Art the best. Himself. He's Art the best. Himself. A genuine human. Thank you. <laughs> and then uh, you want to zoom into that right there? Excuse me? Let's get it! <laughs> All right. Yeah, keep doing what you're doing, man. Thank you. Thank you so much. What's your name? Aiden. Aiden. Good to meet you, man. Nice to meet you, man. Honestly. Thank you, bro. Yeah, of course. All right, babe. We got what? like five minutes left. Five minutes left of the convention. What? Can we do Buy Everything Mortal Kombat? Five minutes? Buy Everything Mortal Kombat? Five minutes. Let's go. Heck, you know, I'm just... Psych. I'm just kidding. Psych. You know how much this costs? <laughs> I can't spend it anymore. It's so furry. Cage fam, what's going on? This is Troy Baker. You might know me better as Aaron Black, fastest gun in Mortal Kombat. Don't even come at me with that attitude. I don't even, that's not one of his lines. I just made that up. That's why I'm not a writer, but instead I'm an actor for it. So uh, David reached out to me to see if I could share with you my favorite Christmas memory? Woof. I don't even know. I've done some pretty cool things for Christmas. Um, I got to ski the Alps with my wife on Christmas Day. That was that was pretty that was pretty awesome. Uh, my favorite gift that I've ever been given. I got a bike. My first bike. I thought it was pretty cool when I got that. But I also got a pair of drumsticks, and that's what made me want to play drums. These are really hard. Narrowing it down. Um, the main thing is that we all give each other the Christmas spirit. This is where I start improvising. To you, everyone, part of the Cage Fam, I wish you the happiest of holidays. What would be my favorite gift? I'm here with the original Johnny Cage himself. <laughs> you got Cage. <laughs> Ready. So we are going to go and rock, paper, scissors, best of three. Let's see who wins. Right. 